Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel, and I had a request from someone saying if there was, in Windows itself, a tool to check for faulty RAM memory modules. And sure, there is one. It's an old tool. It's been there for a long time, but it actually is very decent in detecting problems. So how do you get to this tool? Well, go into your search in Windows 11, Windows 10 also, it works, and type Windows Tools. There you'll see that you're going to be sent to the Windows Tools, which is a folder in the control panel. And in the control panel, you have Windows Tools also. Here, you will search for what is the memory, um, uh, here you go, Windows Memory Diagnostics. You double click on it and you'll have two options restart now and check for problems or you can check for problems the next uh, next time you start your computer so depending on if you want to do it now or later you choose one of the two options once that is done the when you will restart you will have a automatic test done in what is the standard mode which for a lot of RAM memory problems could be enough to detect that there's some issues. If you wish to test more, there's also an F1. You press F1 on your keyboard. This will bring up a more advanced version of the test that is possible to actually check. So basic, standard, and extended will be also the uh, memory test that you can go. Extended, of course, will be much longer. We'll do a variety of different types of tests, but um, this will really check uh, your RAM memory to make sure that it is correct. You press the F10 to apply the changes that you've actually given here, and you let it do its test. And if something comes back wrong, well, you know that maybe there could be uh, faulty memory modules. Now, why should you do this if um, you, and, and what should, indication actually should make you think that maybe you should try a memory test? Uh, well, first of all, if your PC is always going right and always going fine, you don't have to do this. But if your PC freezes regularly, does blue screens of death and, you know, at, at random times, uh, does all sorts of weird things. Uh, Windows doesn't behave the way it should be. And uh, especially, you know, you do a clean install and all is bizarre. Uh, do check it out. A PC can still work with faulty modules, but often it will crash or have issues along the way. Um, I see a lot of people saying, well, you know, Windows isn't reliable. It's crashing all the time. I always tell myself every time somebody comments like that, well, I think you got a faulty RAM module because it is much more common than people think. So this is one way. There are, of course, third-party tools you can download, but that tool from Microsoft isn't too bad, actually. So you can test out your memory modules and see if they're fine. If you have, once again, random freezes, blue screens, and problems all the time on your PC. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.